Just, you know, like avoiding five cars in front of you, which is like a human. Not touching the steering wheel is definitely fun, and this robot taxi can take me from point A to point B. Let's find out, guys. I'm gonna engage it right now. We're gonna see how FSD handles from this parking lot. The car turns on the indicator, moving, and started moving very, very good, immediately proceeding. And you know, like it takes its time to look on the left side, right side, though it knows there is nothing on the parking lot. It's kind of an empty parking lot, but in parking lot, the car goes a little slow and it takes definitely its time. And now it is proceeding. If you're not familiar with me, my name is Anato Mohammed, and I love to film Tesla full self driving videos in New York. And we are moving, we're gonna make a right turn over here. And we're gonna find out how Tesla FSD handles this whole drive. This will be a 13 minutes drive and we're gonna find out how FSD handles. So the car stopped for the first time and now make that right turn very good. Even if we move to the right turn lane or we could just easily go straight and make that right turn. But the car decided to go from a different route and which I respect, you know, like uh, whatever the car wants to do, let's just, you know, like help the car to do that. I don't wanna just, you know, like uh, disengage and, um, you know, like do something else. So the car is taking us and without any problem, I'm not touching the steering wheel, not touching the paddle or brake and the car is doing everything for me and I'm just gonna talk to you guys and we are using the latest and greatest for hardware 3, 12.6.4 with 2025.14.7, so 14.7. So this will have definitely less nag compared to our previous version, but the FSD version is same, but they fix few bugs here and there. So we are going and yeah, guys, so hopefully you like that. So we are making a right turn after the light just changed and we definitely and perfectly make that right turn immediately moving to the left side really don't know why it could just easily like stay over there but it decided to at our probably prefer to stay in the middle and now we uh, slow down for another traffic light and the car seems very confident and the weather seems very nice too. And our car is going, wow, it is changing another lane. Wow, why you need to do that? Wow, that was great though, but I'm not very comfortable with it because there is a car very near to us and you just change the lane. Probably just, you know, like avoiding five cars in front of you, which is like a human, like, I would probably do that, but the car did it perfectly. Amazing, amazing guys, just want to tell you that. So we are going, as you can see, the light just changed again and our car started moving and we are currently on the very right side of the road and our car started moving. We need to probably change a two lane after a few miles, like exactly 1.5 mile to make a left turn and we're gonna see how FSD does over there. We're just 11 minutes away from our destination. The light just changed again, the traffic light I'm talking about. And then uh, we're gonna make a left turn after 1.5 miles, guys. Also, if you're not familiar with me, as I told you, my name is Ananto Mohammed. And if you wanna join our YouTube community, there is a join button and that's like $5 a month. It's just like a coffee amount for you, but it will really help me and my production and my family uh, to keep continue making these kind of videos. That'll be very, very helpful and generous from you. Uh, so yeah, guys, we just come over here. There is a te Tesla store in front of us. Uh, they're like, they are running so many good promotions right now. I really want to get that Model Y, the new one with that bumper camera and everything. But currently my financial situation is not like that. Um, uh, so, you know, like, not every time whatever you want you can just purchase but uh, I'm really looking towards it and let's see when I can you know like purchase that so uh, also Tesla is running like probably 1.99 um, uh, interest rate and there are like so many other features um, and uh, things uh, they're running right now they even uh, run a promotion I just got a message on my phone that hey you can take a car from us for 48 hours so you can demo drive a Tesla new model Tesla Y or 3 
for 48 hours. Not even three, it's probably like ASX and Cybertruck too. So you can take any Tesla car for 48 hours and you know like drive it and uh, test it and feel that feel it like uh, how it's gonna be with every day you know like basis so uh, if you are interested just go on tesla test um, store or you know like book it on the online i try to do that on online but i don't see that option like hey there is like 48 hours after you have to return it or something it just says when you're gonna pick it up but it doesn't tell you that when you're gonna return so probably you have to go to that store for now and then find out like when you're gonna return it so we're going as you can see and our car is going i'm not very comfortable when the camera is outside and you know like uh, uh we're filming and it is windy and uh you know we're kind of going 51 and the camera is mounted on the roof not very comfortable with that thing so we just changed the lane and move to the left side because we're gonna make a left turn on that upcoming traffic light so let's find out how FSD does things here guys so we're gonna make a left turn on that upcoming traffic light it turns on the indicator one more time because we're gonna make a left turn as I told you and slows down very very good job there also um just an update for you guys uh, whoever watched my how i record this kind of video there is a video i made uh, earlier probably six months ago how i how i record my screen tesla screen there is just one update i want to give you previously i was using a google tablet or android phone to record the screen and every time i connect that there is a glitch the all the graphics are glitching and what you need to do the first time you have to reset the graphics how just pressing those two scroll wheel button and then the second time it goes and fix itself but whenever the windshield wiper running and everything it messed up again so I found out if you use an iPad that problem is solved you don't need to do that scroll wheel things whenever you connect to your iPad it just records perfectly without any issues like there is no glitch nothing at all and it looks very good on iPad and the iPad mini I have you can just lay it over here on the charging pad it doesn't charge but the good thing is it fits over there so it doesn't even wiggle or stuff like that way uh, you know like it's very convenient I saw like with the iPad and ever, everything but like a stuff like that so seems very convenient for me so I just changed that ta Android tablet to an iPad and probably gonna use that for recording so that's just that small update for you if you watched that previous video uh, that will be probably helpful for you too so yeah we're gonna make a left turn as I told you um, so after that light change we're gonna make a left turn but we definitely need to wait wow that car went so fast like i i almost shake him over here so we're gonna make a left turn and we definitely need to wait for those light to be changed from red to green and we're gonna see how it handles because this is a, a wide left turn because there are like three lane on the left side and they're like just one lane on the right side so we just have to go to that one lane um, and now the light turns into red and then we have to wait for the opposite side and then we can make that left turn so let's find out how FSD uh, handles right guys um, we're just seven minutes away from our destination seems very convenient didn't touch the steering wheel at all but we're going and we're filming the car seems very confident and the weather seems fine too my windshield is a little dirty but still the car is handling everything very nicely and smoothly it probably knows like i can feel fsd is trying to go you see like that is what I felt yesterday when I was filming. You see, it was going in the wrong direction. So it now fixed itself. It was 
that's the hard thing like when there is no car sometimes this kind of wide turn the car goes into the wrong lane or half lane of that that side and then uh, come back to our lane if that makes sense to you so what I was saying like I noticed that uh, yesterday when it's time to change the light I don't know how FSD knows like exactly here the light will change probably it is also seeing that uh, you know like other side traffic light when it turns red green to red so it knows like now this is my turn and FSD was very confident like immediately it started moving like very good like it's, it didn't even waste any time and just you know like started very very good like like amazing guys I, I really don't know how it does it but it knows like exactly when the light will change so yeah we're just six minutes away the car is going without any problem any hesitation or any problem so that is a great thing and now our car is going guys very very good job there and we're gonna stop on this stop sign and then wait for three seconds and then we can go very good not even touching anything the steering wheel or even the brake paddle or the acceleration paddle but the car is doing everything by itself which is amazing so yeah guys probably didn't even saw that pothole hit that pothole I really wish that FSD will one day uh, recognize those potholes and avoid those so we're going the light is still green hopefully FSD will be able to make it uh, sometimes this kind of situation when the light just change FSD breaks a little hard um, it feels like um, it just wants to you know like a stop and then sometimes decide the second time but in that area the light was green so we didn't have any hard time now we're gonna play a game because we're just five minutes away from our destination and that game is I'm gonna tell you the number one number and you're gonna just comment that number or whatever you want so in today's episode the number is six so just write down six in the comment or whatever you want in the comment section that'll be great you can um, talk about my video quality or whatever you want you know like just share with us with the community so that I understand like you watch the video till now so uh, one more thing is we stop for this stop sign the car is kind of stuck like now it started moving it takes a little bit more time compared to other stop signs probably five to seven seconds even though there are like no vehicle on both sides but still there is just the car waited over there a bit longer um, just want to put it out there so you understand you understand like what I'm trying to say um, so yeah guys um, so also if you want to grab our FSD beta bumper magnet that's for especially for FSD drivers who drive on FSD and you want to tell other people that your car is driven by Tesla not by you uh, there is a website link that's that is my website that is iamananto.com you can go over there or even Amazon I also have an Amazon link over there so two link you can go either of these and get that FSD beta bumper magnet not beta it should be FSD supervised bumper magnet right so just go over there and grab it that'll be great too that will also support me and my channel so uh, if you should know this uh, about this traffic it could just come from a different route but it preferred to and choose to do that from here uh, really don't like that because it is like four minutes it's just one minute from my house but it increases up to four minutes and this is a very long traffic so we're gonna see how FSD handles it's just gonna be like you know like uh, stop and go so I'm not gonna talk just enjoy the video guys so I press that acceleration to tell the car go because it is taking a little time and the light just changed we have to wait another minute probably I had to press that acceleration because there are like so many vehicle behind me and I just don't want to make people bothered you know like just sitting over here and the car was like confused because they're like other cars going so this is the first time I press that acceleration you can count this and assist 
or disengagement, whatever you want to prefer, because this is a self-driving Uber, you cannot just do anything. It could just easily do that if I don't press anything, but it's just like, you know, like don't wanna make people, you know, like bothered or something like that. So I prefer to press that acceleration to tell the car go. So now we're gonna have to wait one more time. Uh, for this traffic light and if um, everything uh, is good we're gonna make a right turn and end the video if you enjoyed the video guys please hit that subscribe button that will really help me and that is absolutely free to do so please hit that subscribe button that will be amazing guys right so yeah we're going and we're just stuck on this traffic light and after that we can move and make that right turn have to change one lane and then we can do that so let's see how if it handles the last one minute Still waiting for green light, the light just changed, our car is proceeding, no problem at all. Now we're gonna change and move to the right lane because we're gonna make a right turn and hopefully you again enjoy the video. If you did, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Thank you for watching and I greatly appreciate your time because you spend your 10 minutes or 20 minutes in this video. I greatly appreciate that. I love you so much. I'm gonna end the video right over here after we make this right turn. Thank you for watching guys and have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day.